Hello and welcome back to more Graveyard Keeper. We are quickly diving up to Snake because apparently he does not wait until the end of the night to leave. We are of course getting the Envy Charged Shard, so gotta do that quickly. I previously started recording this and did something first and then he walked off, so here's our chance. About the rumors. You know Snake, there's been rumors about what happened in town recently. What are you talking about? You probably heard the recent theft of a large sum of money from the bishop. No, I haven't. Tell me all the details. Here, take this. Since you can't be a suspect, you, since you have an alibi, that means there's somebody in town who's even surpassed your skills. A thief that doesn't leave any clues. Could this really be? Absolutely. Plus, the story is spreading not just in town, but in the village too. That's not good. We got that shard. Well, okay. We'll see who's more reputable. Can you find some items for me? Can you find something from the town? I can find anything, just name it. A mirror of pride, an eternal burning coal, and a salty fork. That's some weird stuff. You may have noticed I'm working on a very important project right now. So I'm a little short in time, but if you help me, maybe I'll help you. Oh, okay. Everybody knows the mirror has the bit. The bishop has the mirror. People say the mirror helps him talk to his boss. <laughs> An eternal burning coal, the Inquisitor's guard told me that it's his master's most precious artifact. He carries it around with him in his pocket. It's burning him all the time. That's why he's so angry. A salty fork. Your friend, the merchant, has one of those. It's weird. We normally use spoons in the town in our hands. Apparently it helps him eat a lot. Thanks. I hate politeness. About the ritual. About the last task. What's my final task going to be? Now we have a hunter's medallion. It's all coming together for me. You see, it can help you open the gate to the 11th level. I need you to go deeper and bring me a golden apple. That's the last thing I need for the ritual. Okay. We got him in time, which means we have got the third charge shard. We can complete that. But we need to be diving into the mine. Ah, uh, not the mine, the dungeon. Which is going to be a lot of work, I think. But let's take a moment to uh, leave some things here. I realize that most of what we'll need to do right now is prep for Snake next week. We also have the something coming from the astrologer on Astrology Day. That's it, Yurik. I managed to charge the rest of the shards. Thank you, Keeper. Let's finish what we started. Same as before. You sit down. I'll turn it on. On the count, three. Yurik, how are you feeling? It's so peculiar, I feel so lightweight inside. But at the same time, like a part of me has just been erased. Thank you, Keeper, for all the things you've done for me. I need some time to rest and think about my next move. I hope it'll be alright. So we now have the charged Lust Charge Shard. Nice. I guess I shouldn't bother him yet. That makes sense. So we're going to pull out. We're going to head up and check on what's happening up here but i want to start looking at like health potions or or other food that's good for health and we're also going to fill this so insert sloth shard envy lust so sloth illustration is the astrologer sitting by those books just letting them sit there uh envy is Snake being upset about not being able to be integrated with the others? And Lust is uh, Ms. Charm going into a lady's house, I guess. 
By a lady's house, I mean like, you know, not just some random. But anyways. <laughs> right, what sword do we currently have? We have just the steel sword. We need a damask sword if we can make it. Now, I know we can make one. We've just got to see if we've got what it takes. These are also good hearts ish. Right. So let's head to the house. Now, what food is good for help? We also need to make some porcelain urns. So these don't actually specifically... Oh, no. Okay. We're making some jelly. Oops. There we go. Made jelly. Jelly consumed. These don't actually touch on the health they regain. And I don't know if that's accidental or just these are only... That. What about anything here? We've got berry pudding, which would require butter. Honey cake, which looks really easy to make. Lasagna. We could make 100 quality lasagnas. That looks actually surprisingly easy. It's strange that it doesn't require pasta first. Um, deep sleep energy generation, deep sleep, handyman mood. You have a better chance to craft something of good quality. That sounds pretty good. Tough mood, incoming damage is reduced. Um, I kind of like that. That just requires edible mushrooms. So I'm going to have this one made. But I'm also going to see about... Oh, very dark. So we got that. The porcelain ones require white powder as well. Two white powder per. I don't know how much white powder we have. But I'm going to guess it is not that much. What's our pickaxe like? Our pickaxe is perfect as well. So let's have a look. We've got some salt. White powder, white powder. We've got... We can make 30. And we want double that. So... Let's put that there. What else can I put in here? Not a lot, hey. Um, okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to put the dark heart and the wooden stick. We are going to go up to the quarry. I'm going to check what he's been making. Has he been doing anything? Not by the looks of it. Why not? I don't think there's a... I don't think there's a miner on this. Alright, we'll have to put a miner up there. Anyways, that can... That can wait. Actually... That can wait. I will, I will work with that shortly. Right now, what I'm thinking is I'm going to mine a whole bunch of white paint so we can get the... Um, thing working. And by the thing, I mean specifically the... Uh, porcelain. The limestone, the white powder. Strange 
should I keep getting not enough? It's like it's trying to do something else. There we go. Oh, that was a good chunk. Right, so it stopped this again. We have too many stacks of coal. We don't need this much coal. Not now, not ever. Our biggest goal is probably getting... I'm going to say four stacks of limestone. It should be fairly doable. You know, we're probably already up to almost two stacks. The biggest thing is just mining until it drops. There we go. What are we up to now? We're up working on our third stack, so that's good. I think what it is, is when the things drop, they shift you just a little. And I think that's what's happening. We get shifted just a little. <clears throat> and we can't move back into the right place. There we go. I think that's enough. Nope, apparently I picked up everything but. Right, we got 40. So, let's mine until we get... Nah, I'm happy with 40, actually. It's a lasagna, and how, how does the lasagna do? Oh, so lasagna literally just... Yeah, literally just does 40 energy and hard work. You spend less energy with pickaxes. I mean, I don't hate it, but I would like some some more healing stuff. Maybe we will have to put the, uh, the white powder guy to use. I guess. So we're going to dump all of that in there. And I think I can say, hey, I want a white powder. And apparently it makes three per, so... Boom, he can start work on that. You, my friend, I would like you to work on some heal potions, which require chaos solutions. Okay, there you go. You're working on heal potions, you're working on white powder. Good. Let's go to the Inquisition Hill. I think this is better go from here. It is rough day and hopefully we can make it on time. If if we can't, it, it's okay. I mean, at the end of the day, I don't even think I can talk to him about his potential thing. I'm looking for an eternal burning coal. I heard from one of your guardsmen that you might have an eternal burning coal. I need it to reunite with my family. Family. I had a family, but they were all burned. My wife and son. Burned alive in my house. My house was lit on fire by the great blast and... My son was so young, I even couldn't find his remains. 
but I found this coal among the ashes. Why not? And it's been burning ever since, fueling my anger. I see. I'm sure the explosion was caused by a witch coven or cultists. I founded the Inquisition to avenge all evil. No, see. I can't give it to you until I've burned them all. No, see. Maybe one day, with your help, but not before. So we have one more task to do for him then. I don't know what that is though. Um, if we find the Inquisitor, yeah, he's at 90. We'll be able to get the Bishop and the uh, Merchant. Miss Charm needs to save Wagner and we're waiting to speak with the Astrologer tomorrow about that. Uh, Uric needed to be visited in a day, which I think counts as today. So let's pop around and see how, uh, how he's doing. Ask how he feels. How you doing? Oh, oh, perfectly well today, thank you. Oh. Yesterday I feel felt a bit ill, but luckily it was only temporary. What are you going to do next? Oh. You know, I still haven't decided yet. I'd like to travel the world, see the world. Oh. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Oh. I'll walk to the village tonight, I think, and someday soon I'll start packing. Well, I hope you find what you're looking for. I, I am so confused because look, oh, wow. Okay. I wasn't able to mine that before. Oh, cause I didn't have the, is it really the, um, where is it? Gems, gathering diamond technology. My gosh, there were five diamonds just sitting down there. Waiting for me. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? All right. So with that done. Uh, where do we make weapons again? Not there. Is it here? Yes, the Damascus sword requires three gold jewelry details. To make gold jewelry details, we require a gold bar, uh, faith, and the steel parts, which we all have. What I'm curious about is whether or not we have, we have no gold nuggets. So... What we're going to need to do is sort out those gold nuggets so we can get the, the gold things. That sounds like the task. All right. Well, we can work on that for sure. I'm going to take this fella up to the quarry and put them into work. We're going to put both of them into work in the quarry. And hopefully they get just that. Your entire job will only be transporting the gold. Can I build more... <laughs> um... We need to build more trunks, I think. 
more trunks that we can store everything else that just comes up here and then work out what to do with it. Wait, can we... Place for a lantern. Ah, oh, no. Okay, so what my plan is for this, we're going to have them creating, mining these pieces, right? From there, he is going to chop them. And then from there, they're just going to wind up in here. And hopefully, eventually, we start getting some gold. Because, quite simply, we need a lot of gold. We need at least several gold pieces. Just like right then. Just picked up a gold nugget straight away. And another gold nugget. Okay, what is going on here? I just need one. No, nah, not silver. I need one more gold. Any moment now. I think I think he's onto my I think they're onto my sneaky trick. Okay, with that, I think I'm going to call it because we are not going to get this anytime soon. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe. I'll be out with another video tomorrow. So uh, depending on when you're watching this. So take care, look after yourselves. And until next time, bye for now.